Welcome back to the channel. It's your favorite and the most talked about youngest ambassador, Ambassador Vic, right here at Takwa Estate, located in the western region of Ghana. I mean, anytime I come to this city, I feel so much proud and happy, not just because this city is filled with gold, but it's, it's filled with youth who are more ambitious and willing to do something for themselves, not waiting for any private or government institution to employ them. Today, I'm here at Iconic Fragrance. I'm going to talk to the young gentleman who is most talked about regarding to his condition of service and how he treats his customers at Takwa Estate near Shooters Park. So let us go and see the inspiring story and what he has to say for us. Once again, my name is Ambassador Vicks. You're watching Africa Insider. Before then, if you are new to the channel, kindly subscribe, you comment, you like, and you share. If you're already a subscriber, thanks for coming back to the channel. Boss, you're welcome. Thank you. Very much. Nice one. Why is it that people are talking about you like that? Okay. Um, I have this thing that goes like, if you really love what you do and then you understand it better, um, everything becomes so So, um, starting this business, I would say I had a few challenges. You know? mm -hmm. I had a few challenges. Um, it wasn't easy getting there. But with the help of some few friends that I think I know, we've been able to get here. Yeah. Yes. So, when was this business started? Um, it's not even up to a year now. A year, okay. And people are talking about this business? Yes. yes. Wow. Let us go directly into what you do before we come back to the questions and all that. What are some of the types of fragrances that you sell here? Okay, so one thing about perfume is um, perfumes are supposed to smell great, bring back good memories and then also uh, be affordable so that anyone who really loves and understands smells can afford. Uh -huh. So what um, I did was stocking up unique and affordable fragrances. Okay. From from Dubai? From Dubai. Emirates? Okay. Okay. So the types of fragrances you sell? Um, most of them are, I would say, alternative to the common brands that we know. So when I say the common brands, um, the common brands are the Creed Aventus, Amwaj, Dior Sauvage. They yeah, are the common brands. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. You understand? Uh -huh. Okay. So people don't all that know the necessity of them buying fragrance and wear them. What do you think are some of the necessities or the importance of fragrance to humanity? First of all, I need to know if you are the one going to wear it. Are you the one going to wear it? And then um, to what events? Is it to wear church or a special occasion? Okay. You know, special occasion, you know, demands some attention. You understand? If I'm giving you a fragrance that um, will be under a special occasion, mm -hmm. It needs to be a program that will get the attention, grab attention. When you get there, you should even you should even announce your coming before you get there. Like hey, I'm hey, yeah. ambassador is yeah. here. Yeah. Okay. You understand. Okay. And then when you leave, your smell or your memory should linger. Even when you are out. You so that means we have fragrance that you wear when you are going on a date. Oh yes. And those those should be mild and sweet. If let's say for instance for guys, that one should be mild and sweet, you understand? Mm -hmm. And then for ladies, you know, ladies need, you know, floral scent. Floral scent. Floral scent. Okay. Very yeah. sweet ones, you understand? Okay. Yes. So that will be um, the best fragrances to recommend for ladies. What are mm -hmm. some of the examples, the specified fragrances that men should wear or are purposely meant for men? Because okay. I use Matrix Men. Um, so, Dior Sauvage is one successful smell or fragrance mm -hmm. that every guy I think should wear. Okay. And then, uh, Creed Aventus, that is the, for the bossy guys, you mm -hmm. understand? And then also, you should try something loud for the party people, for the loud guys, you understand? Mm -hmm. I think I'm white. I'm white. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, what do you call it? Nice fragrances. Eh? We have we have um, intense, we have mild, yeah. we have loud, okay. 
Okay. The intent should be the universal one. Which the, that is the one that anyone can wear. And then the mouth should be more like the office. Alright. Right. And then Lao should be the party. Yes. Wow. I think we have types of fragrances and you're teaching us to wear and when you should wear them. I when I was coming, I was having a conversation with my director that there's is there any fragrance that when a lady wears it catches the attention of men? So what is the, the specified fragrance? Okay, so um well, we have a lot. Okay. We have we have a lot. Mm. And then one thing is if we should name one, eh? If we should name one, I specifically will go for Rehana, Riri. Rehana, Riri. Riri. Yes. Okay, why? Why why because Rihanna is loud out there. Okay. And then with the kind of smells that Rihanna has in her, um, every, everyone talks about Rihanna's smells like heaven. Mm -hmm. You understand? Mm -hmm. And then having a party, a party smell, you know, for ladies, it should be um, Britney Spears, All fantasy. Right. All right. So these two people are more like um, out there. You mm -hmm. understand? They're already out there. But the type of fragrance that you wear, mm -hmm. Tell can tell your personality type. Oh yeah, very true. So for example, if someone is outgoing, I'm kind of outgoing person. Then I mean, it should be people. loud. It should be loud. It should be loud. You should get the attention. So what is the type of fragrance? What what, what is that fragrance that I should wear? Um, okay, so one fragrance should be one. Okay. So that okay. Very sweet. Mm -hmm. If you are the outgoing type, and then you want guys or ladies to get the attention, fragrance should be one. You also bad two. Amwaj. I will never leave Amwaj. Amwaj. Amwaj is one six smell okay. from the Emirates. Okay. So you, should, you can tell. Since uh, since you buy all these things from you can pull them from Emirates. Are all the fragrances made in um, Dubai or they are made in different uh, countries and Okay. So one thing is I make I make some of these fragrances myself. Oh. Yes, yes. Nice one. Great. So what I do is it's very hard for a, an outgoing guy or a party guy to tell this is the fragrance I'm wearing. Okay. Really hard. So the thing is, I get the common brands. I'm large, really, you know, the, the common brand that everybody mm -hmm. I get them in all your things. And every fragrance has perfume oil. And the perfume oil is the main ingredient. So we add all the alcohol and water the alcohol is to let it evaporate okay get out there okay. the water is to you know limit the evaporation point the main ingredient is the oil so let me um, do this all right test let me ask you this question no. don't rub it no. i shouldn't rub it no no that's the wrong thing people do so this is a, a, a evaporate, evaporated one yes so let the uh, what the alcohol get out okay when the alcohol get out you see the oil Lining on your skin. Okay. You and this is a typical oil, perfume oil. Perfume no oil. Alcohol, no water. I have questions to ask about this. What type of fragrance should someone wear when the person has a dry skin and oily skin? I would prefer mild. 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 Okay. You know, because you have oily skin, the fragrance itself is in an oil base. Oil you base. understand? So okay. When the alcohol is dried your oily skin will let this oil that is settled on your skin mm -hmm. last longer it's longer dry skin i would say you should go for oil based fragrance okay you should have you should use this this will dry in about two three hours but when you're using a typical oil oh, yeah. perfume um, you can have it you know for about 12 hours 12 hours yes. okay. all right let us know starting business i think we've talked much about the perfume perfume if you need any additional information i'll bring out this contact so that you're contacting if you're interested then you um you come to a shop his shop is located at low cost just at the junction of i throw in or um uh, shooters park yeah. just visit the place and i uh, think you'll be sorted out doing business in ghana is very difficult with the registration process and all that uh, does it sometimes scare you of not continuing what you wanted to do um, I think the taxing is too much. Okay. That's what I would say. That's the taxing, right? Yeah. Registering a business here in Ghana um, is quite difficult. So um, the processes that you go through and the taxes that you are going to pay. Mm -hmm. Starting up, no one helps. 
-hmm. Started one hour and helped them then um, uh, continue uh, giving the, 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 the success of it. And then when the money is coming and then you gathering a junk, you know, to the government and mm -hmm. buy you know, I don't think that's the right way to do it. Do you think that the government should have tax free for small small businesses? Um, I think so. I think so. A business like mine shouldn't, you know, be paying you know much taxes like what I'm paying, you understand? So I think the government can do so. Are you making enough from this business? I'm not making enough because most of the money I'm making is going to the government. And I'm also employing someone here. The one that I have employed I need to pay. Mm, a lady? A lady. I think I saw her. Yeah. Very beautiful lady. So you can come here. So I see. Paying the lady and then paying the government. How much do I get to, you know, feed on? Okay, in a summarized version of it, during, the, during your discussion, you said that you make some of the fragrances. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Did, you, did you learn it somewhere or you just um, learned it for yourself? No, I didn't learn it anyway. Okay. You know, I'm a fan of perfume and as I said earlier, I don't mind spending a lot of perfumes, you understand? So I realized going to a place or going to a party for someone to tell me the kind of perfume you are wearing, I, I, I sometimes get so fumed, okay. you understand? And mm -hmm. Which is something I don't think I like. Okay. And I believe a lot of people don't like it if you are my kind, you okay. like perfumes. Mm -hmm. you, don't want pe you don't want people to know the kind of perfumes you are wearing. You understand so mm. what i did is i get a common brand in all of this. So this is a three combo a tom ford. Tom ford. we all know tom ford is one of the expensive brands yeah the expensive brands you understand yeah. so i get them in all of this mm. and then so this is a combination of comfort amber leather comfort black coaching and then comfort these are all you know like loud smells you understand and then i would say this uh, one smell for the party person the party guy mm -hmm. so i recommend this smell for the party guys no one gets to know the smell you are wearing and then okay you will be all over it yeah. is all because it's um what do you call it uh, for your base. Yeah, base yes i think one last question before we go what advice do you have for young people the youth who are um, depending on the government or any private institution to employ them after after school. That is a big, big, big question, and yeah. um, it's, it's also an opportunity. To Advise them for me. Been there. Um, what I would say is, they shouldn't depend on anyone. <laughs> Whatever business you are starting, no matter how small it is, if you, if you have passion for that, keep pushing. It will make sense one day. I started at the roadside, so see where I am. And no one knows where I will be in two, three, four, five years to come. Of course. So just push it, just believe in what you are doing. Okay. For me, it's good for you. you, know, you have it. All right, so I'm here with the CEO of Iconic Fragrance. Icon, me, I'll, I'll call him Icon. Icon. Yes, he has talked about the perfume and the types of perfume you should wear. I think if the video that you watch is not all that more in depth for you, you can just call him so that he educates you on that. Don't forget that the business is located at low cost, just at the junction of um, Aifro Inn Hotel or Shooters Park. It's just the real side. Your last words. My last words. Um, um, I think I have too much words, but uh, I will select a few. That is good. Believe in yourself. Uh, keep it should be a good one it shouldn't be something that will affect you know, negatively on people that are around you because you have a whole lot of people depending on you if you are in the right way all right thank you welcome all right thank you very much you're welcome thank you